hello friends this is my react application in the backend and from here i can disable and enable my internet so you can see that wow user is online this is what my application is saying currently but once i will disable this it will say oops user is offline again if i right click and click on enable and you can see that wow user is online so friends in this video we are going to learn in react.js how we can check either user is online or not we will create a custom hook so you can use this in multiple places of your application and that hook will return us true if user will be online and return us false if user will be offline so video is going to be more important and before starting the video i would like to request you to subscribe to our youtube channel for our regular videos so without any delay let's start so friends first of all you can see that we have created a basic react.js project and i have opened my app.js which exists in my source folder we will write our logic in a separate custom hook so we can reuse that in multiple places of our app so first of all inside the source folder i will create a new folder named hooks inside this i'm going to type here use is online.js whenever you create a custom hook make sure to use the keyword use before your hook name now you need to press enter so here inside our this custom hook we need to write our custom logic so first of all i will type here rfce so this is just a code snippet for a basic component which is a functional component and here inside this custom hook we need to import two built-in hooks the first one would be use effect let me type here comma use effect and use state we will use these two hooks in our logic so now inside uh, the our main function i will type here const is online and set is online so we will get these two variables from use state so basically uh, this will be our state is online and set is online will be a function that will be used to update our this state variable the next part is we need to assign the default value to the state so i will type here navigator dot on line in camel case so if users will have an active internet connection when he will load this uh, component in his application or when this component or this hook will be mounted so the default value will be set is online to true and if he will not have an internet connection while this component will be mounted or while it will this component will be loaded into dom so the default value for our this is online state will be false from here i will remove this return statement which is returning a div and here i will return is online so whatever value this state will contain we have to return that value and now inside this we need to call the use effect here it will receive two parameters a callback function and a dependency empty array so it will only load once so now we need to set on click uh, event listeners on our window for example let me type here window dot add event listener so the first listener we are going to type here which is which will be online and here let me type here handle online semicolon i need to copy this function from here and we need to declare this function here like const handle online is equal to i will type here an arrow function and set is online to true for example when the component was loaded the user connection was have not an internet connection but once he will connect it to the internet this event listener will be called and once this event listener will be called it means the handle online function will be called inside our this function we have assigned an arrow function to this and inside the body of this arrow function what we are going to do we are using this set is online function which is a use state provided function we can use this to update our is online state so its value will become true so similarly let me copy and paste this for example user again become offline so we need to set an offline listener and here let me type here handle offline i will again copy and paste this here handle offline and set is online to false so friends this was the logic uh, that will 
check either user is online or not now simply what we need to do inside our this app.js component first of all let me run this application so i can show you the current output first of all i will type here npm start and you can see that this is the simple ui that provided by react when we install a new react js project so let me close this from here if i will remove this header tag and its content so what you will see you will see an empty blank page and now inside our app.js we need to import this custom hook that we have created same as you import the built-in hooks so simply i will type here import use is online from hooks the folder that we have created here and use is online the name of our this component which is use is online so let me save this inside our app component i'm going to create a simple variable let is online is equal to use is online press semicolon and inside our app what i'm going to do i will type here some logic like is online then you have to press you have to display that user or wow user is online after this i will type this colon else oops user is offline so now you can see that uh wow user is online is displaying let me again refresh so you can see that because i am online now so it is displaying me online now for example we will disable our internet connection and i will show you the output right click on your windows click on run and here you need to type in your run n cpa.cpl press ok you will see this window and from here let me right click on it and i will click disable so when i click on disable you can see that oops user is offline and again let me click on enable so you can see that once it's enabled it is displaying that user is online so friends i hope that this video will be helpful for you if you have any question you can ask us in the comment section we will try to answer your question and please subscribe to our youtube channel for our regular videos and finally thanks for watching